Perhaps it was the eyes of the wolf, measured, calm, knowing. Perhaps it was the intense sense of family. After all, wolves mate for life, are loyal partners, create hunting communities, and demonstrate affectionate patience in pup rearing. Perhaps it was a rigid hierarchy of the packs. Each wolf had a place in the whole and yet retained its individual personality. Perhaps it was their great, romping, ridiculous sense of fun. Perhaps it was some celestial link with the winter night skies that prompted the wolf to lay his song in the icy air. For the native people who lived with the wolves, there was much to learn from them. Is it any wonder that the myths of many tribes characterize the wolves not as killers, but as teachers?